that's the saddle we came in on. It would be better to stay uh, a little further, get up on the high point, uh, canyon left there, come down the ridge, and uh, then uh, enter into the canyon here where we are. But we dropped down uh, 600 feet from the saddle to here, and there's a, uh, a junction right down here. Confluence of the two drainages right there. You might even be able to come down there. Might be better, a little more exciting. That's another possibility. I got uh, 2.3 miles, uh, 6,350 feet. Here is uh, R2. My uh, GPS indicates 61, 20 feet. Just looking back up canyon. This would be a, another alternative to coming down into the gully would be to repel that uh, cliff there. If you were of a mind to do that. We are anchoring on this tree here. I'm not sure that made it. Okay, this is the first big repel at Petrero John. Uh, from the anchor that we have, uh, it's about 160 feet down to the bottom. Two overhanging sections. The first one's about uh, maybe 80 feet. The second one's about 20 or 30 feet. All right, so coming down repel number four. We anchored uh, kind of high canyon right around a bit of mountain mahogany. Probably should have uh, extended the anchor though, but well. And after thought, you gotta climb up to. I don't know how many people will come through. Okay. Ta da! There's ISO coming down. Big drop. I make it to be about uh, 190 to 200 feet to this ledge down here. And then there's a short drop over here. I might even be able to down climb it right there. Here she comes. Gonna get a lot of air. Gonna get a lot of air. Yeah, probably most of the way. Once you get it down about another 15 feet, it's free hanging the rest of the way. You got, you got that thing in your leg, Beaner?
There you go. You got enough friction? Okay. I had too much friction. Too much, huh? Well, you know, see? One horn. One horn. That's too much for me. I should just go canyoneering mode. Canyon mode and then uh, put the, uh, the, leg, uh, the leg loop in case you need extra friction right away. Right. That's the wrap at the end of the branch of Petrero John Creek that comes off that road that kind of uh, snakes around Reyes Peaks and goes to that flat area. But that branch there has three named falls in it, marked as falls, so that could even be more interesting. That uh, it drops probably a hundred and a uh, hundred feet. There's kind of a ledge there, and then it drops to this overhang again. There's a little, a little closer look. <laughs> 